Hey, my Capricornish. I'm just here doing a couple of weeds while I wash my like five pieces of clothes. It's hot now. I don't like no nothing wet and dirt or just nothing sitting. But but anyway, caps. I was like, something was told me to do the next 48 love read again. So I'm like, all right, I don't know why. So I'm gonna just clear the energy because the last reading was just woo. Apple corners, we be having them stalking. Males and females. <laughs> it's crazy. They crazy, yo. Yeah. They shot out. For real. You know what I'm talking about. Especially, it like, it depends. Like, it don't even depend. If you got Capricorn in your chart, yeah, I'm talking to you. For real. Real shit. We be, it's crazy. I'm talking to be with people and they still be stalking that cat. Like, when you get cat, you can't go back. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> you got half hate go back, but I don't know what's going on. Especially January cat. I'm glad I ain't messing with no guys that been on no bullshit. Yeah. You got a cancer in your energy here. Wanna come in the next 48 with some type of love offer, but you already come up out of dealing with this person in that situation before. Right. So you already know what this is about here. You already come up out of lies with this individual. This individual wanna come back and want to bring toxic toxic shit to your situation. Cat, Capricorn. We don't got time. I hate people coming to my house because I got to clear my energy. Because people be around fake people and I like certain people, but they do. It's too many ups and downs in relationships and something here. And okay, Capricorn, so you, this is the past too. It could be a water sign. You decided to walk away here. You walked away. You was like, I don't feel like dealing with this. And you could be dealing with a water sign. Or you could have a water sign in your chart. But you walked away from some type of connection, some type of workplace, friendship with somebody, relationship. Yeah. But somebody had a negative judgment against them too. I don't know, does you? Some type of karma. Devilish energy. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. Capricorn could be dealing with a water sign. Somebody left somebody out in the cold in the past. Yeah. Something wasn't a marriage or this could have been somebody that was in a, a living together, but they wasn't married. Is how I look at that. Yeah, somebody thought they could have kind of have happiness here. I think with you. But some of their secrets came out and they had a negative judgment here. They was arrogant as fuck. You start realizing and finding out some things here. Or you will be. In love, the next 48. Yeah. They're going to take a chance towards you. But they in devilish energy. You be dealing with Capricorn. Or this is somebody. The devil coming straight for you. This is how he looking. He waiting for you to take a dumb chance. Like, look at this. This is how it is on the table. Like, he waiting for you to take a, a chance. It's some type of chance that you're going to take in the future. The devil waiting for you. So, I don't know what you about to do. You're not going to have a whole world in your hands at this time. You're on the devilish energy. Or you will be around this. This could be you. It don't have to be. I don't like the energy. This is the future, too. I'm trying to see what's going on. Capricorn, this is always some shit. Love, next 48. <sighs> well, Capricorn, this could be you and devilish energy. Don't take a devilish move, Capricorn. If you about to make a move, don't do it right now. It's not the time. Hold back. Hold back for a minute. Six nine could be significant. Hold back. Maybe you should do something July the 9th or 6th. 666 represents the devil. Backwards. Or the 999. See, I'm not sure because I don't really be on the devil shit. <laughs> when he come out, I already know it's toxic. 
narcissist bullshit going on. Yeah, you in between having luck. Like, I'm going to just keep it real. It looked like in your past you just dealt with something. Like you was in a half-happy situation with somebody. But this person, like they had shit with them. And luck wasn't on your side with it. Some some of that shit start coming out. But it's like you're going to take another chance. And it's like, it's going to be the same thing. Let's see. And these cards don't want to talk, so it's fine with me. I want to see because it looks like that you want to like take a chance or a risk. I don't like it. It's going to make you like a fool. Capricorn is trying to what you up to in love next 48, but you, you, let's just say, Holy Spirit. Yeah. It's like the devil waiting for, wow, you got judgment twice. Like, whatever you waiting for, whatever you trying to do is not the time. You don't have your guard up for something that's about to happen. Somebody waiting for something. Somebody waiting for something. Somebody on something. Let's see. Yeah, it's going to happen real fast. You're not going to be on point here. The devil is out to get you. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Or you come up out of dealing with a Virgo. But somebody around you is the devil. Mm. Yeah, you're gonna come up out of not acting like you see it. You see it. You got your you gotta live, you got it under control, I'm saying. You feel what I'm saying? But it's just around you. They waiting for you to take a dumb chance. They want something slick. This is somebody that can't leave the past behind. Somebody's still stressing about you cutting them off, cat. <laughs> it's always us cutting them off. We focus on the bag. This person may see you as arrogant as fuck. You like, I don't give a fuck. Put me done with the Aries. You don't give a fuck about none of that. I know you want to just jump up high. Let me move this because it's swinging and you a kitten. So I don't want to give you a popping yet. But you about to get one. So, Capricorn, they always want some shit. <laughs> we be chilling justice like somebody on something so listen whatever you doing yeah somebody waiting for a tower moment in your life so like somebody really sitting here capricornish wishing something happens to you slowly yeah somebody wishing like ugh. like somebody like look somebody happy when you down they like when tower moments come in your life this person is fucking crazy what else is hanging? <sighs> it's like having a baby around. Oh shit. I'm trying to get everything up here. It's fucking up my video. Alright, that might work. Okay. Alright, Capricornish. Oh wow. Yeah, this person. Ugh. This person here is like, they get anxiety just thinking about you, cat. This is somebody that you come up out of already leaving behind. And you start building something else for yourself. You come up out of dealing with these people here. You stay to yourself. Because they drama and a bunch of bullshit. Bottom line. They unhappy. Got shit going on. Fake. Fake happy. Thinking they got the whole world. Don't got no celebrations on there built like that. And they see you come in with all this good luck. And everything you wish and hope for. Caprice. I said Caprice, no, Capricornish. Caprice is the girl I watch too that says that. Yeah, I watch certain readings only. And not all of them. I can't tell y'all my secret. But Capricorn, this is what they see you as. With all this good luck coming to your side, it's like you get everything like, to your feet, at your knees. They don't know that you did the hard work. You dealt with karma. All you want in your life, Caprice, Capricornish. <laughs> It's peace. They be mad. They in devilish energy because you come up out of devilish energy. They don't know how to take you, Capricorn, because you already know how they coming. You just pray for them and cut them straight off, make shit happen. You come up out of making choices for them, helping them out. If they stuck, that's on them because you just had the pinnacles. Cut out, bitch. You come up out of thinking about fake relationships, friendships, betrayal. You come up out of um, having patience for people. You wasn't using your intuition. You was acting kind of young. 
people is wounded now. They ain't got no new beginning. They want to come back from the past, and they, and they want you to take a chance with them, but you're coming up out of that. You're balanced. You worrying about new love, new things. They don't close cycles with you. They're unhappy, but it's no new beginning here. You're not even thinking about money, but they gossiping about your money here, watching you, have victories, lying on you, telling people bad news, but it's lies, plotting on you, scheming, mad because you walked away from them. They can't budge. You can budge. They're liars here. They don't love their self-divine or others. They probably be trying to do black magic, manipulate gaslight situations. You come up out of having other people shit on your back. You just sit on the throne happy. You want no more up and downs and secrets with people. You done. You don't care if your money come in slow. You are using the Herophant wisdom, man. Cause you the king of pentacles with the queen of pentacles and the Herophant. This shit is lovely. This is what they look at you as. And this is what you are. This is what you embody. Why you think the devil is around you? Why you think the devil is around you? Okay? This is you. The queen and king and Herophon. Bottom fucking line. And this is all earth energy. With Taurus standing in the building with the Herophon. And then we got the Capricorn. This could also be an Aries. Or Tars or Capricorn. That's some shit. So the devil is, yeah, he's going to be hanging around. Next 48 hours in love. So be careful here. Let's see what work will come out with that, though. We're going to go to the hidden truth. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? Next 48 with love. I still wait for you. I still wait for a sign from you. So somebody still like love you. Next 48. I feel you leaving me behind. They know that there's no connection no more here. It's like you done here. <clears throat> this person is like dying inside right now. They're dying because you're leaving them behind. They're dying. They dying inside. Capricornish, I'm telling you, they dying. The timing just wasn't right for us. You realize that. It was just it just was a lot going on. I already see, I already know. You got haters around, you got this around. It's just it is what it is. It's time to move on and seal the bag. And recyclable day is on its way. Believe me. Somebody wants you to believe them in something they telling you. But you like, I don't want you in my space. Like, you being real with this person, you just, you're not dealing with none of that. Their luck expired. Yeah, like, I told people by June the 1st. I don't know if they thought I was playing. Too cool for a loser. Like, somebody may feel like this. I do. Maybe somebody was a jackass. And don't, you didn't feel lucky? That you even had me? Like, sit down somewhere. That's how I look at people. I don't care about my mom. Let's see what else come out for you guys. Holy Spirit. Okay. Oh, drama. It's definitely, I told you that you got the devil right here over top of everything. You got somebody that's out to get you. Why? Because you got a lot of money. Prosperity is in your life. If not, get you in a bad way. Like, for some it could be. But for others, they just don't energy. Like, they want something from you. They want sex from you. They want to have you fucked up. To them, it's not fucked up. But, I mean, they going to be doing a lot. And, and it's just going to end up in drama, is what I'm saying. Like, Capricorn is... I need you to be on point. Cause this is this is this is deep. This is the future. You're gonna come up out of making a decision that needs to be made. You're gonna come up out of completing a cycle. So the way I see in this Capricorn is like, are you gonna take a chance with somebody from the past that's in devilish energy that brought you drama before? Or this is drama coming towards you. 
Yeah, you could be dealing with an Aries or somebody just thinking they the ball. Somebody that you couldn't leave behind. They've been waiting for this time. It's not a new beginning with it's not a new beginning with them. You had S to dance with them. Something gonna end with you. Person, place, or thing. You're gonna try to balance this out. You're gonna come up out of conflict, but you can't move forward with this person. This person takes too many chances. This person gonna bring you sorrow, mourning, grief, sadness. And right now you happy. You got the success, you got the fame. You just want to start a new romance. You should just start a new romance. Whatever this is, somebody needs to start a new romance. God is on your side. Hope, good, arm, and satisfaction. Fuck it with this person. will fuck up your health, your courage. You're not going to be able to adapt. This person just see your money. This person not working. This person is negative as fuck. You want to deal with that? Ooh, I don't. There's, you come up out of a partnership, relationship, friendship with this person before, too. Use your inner strength, is telling you. Use your intuition with this. Because you already creative. You come up out of justice, legal calities, or something with this person. Maybe with legal. This person is just nothing. This, this person is nothing but confusion. They lost of control. They're going to deceive you. You ain't going to win no awards. You can't come together with them. You need to be alone and stop trying to resist the change and start using your creative power and skills. So right here, Capricornish, don't go backwards with somebody here because if you do, it's going to be the worst thing you ever did in your life. I'm going to see what else I can get out for you. This is love. That's 48. That's crazy. I didn't think it was going to be that long. That's my washer. This is 15 minutes in. Next 48. You like you want to just have a, a bunch of bullshit. I've been struggling lately. Somebody may be telling you they struggling. Like, they miss you. They... It's something going on in the next 48 in love. This don't even have to be Capricorn. Because people crazy. I pretend you don't mean that much to me. Somebody may come to you like, I want to tell you so many things. They want to tell you how much they miss you and all this, but you like, I'm kind of done with that. You done with the energy. I am happy that it's over. Like, yeah, you like happy it's over, but this person is like lost without you, dude. Yeah, they lost without you. They mad as fuck. You happy though. You like, I'm just happy. Old wounds and childhood issues need revisiting. So you may be neat and healing maybe from this person, too. You healing right now. This person trying to come back in. You're like, boy, leave me alone. Girl, leave me alone. Acceptance. Yeah, somebody is coming up out of accepting that you're healing right now. Everything happens for a reason. Somebody don't want to see that, but you see this. Wait, the timing is not quite right. Like, whatever happened here... It wasn't the time. It wasn't the time. Yeah, you're vulnerable right now. You can be completely open with this person. Okay. So, you was honest about something with somebody. Tell them somebody, this is just not the right time. It just... You was vulnerable when, when this person came in your life, too. And now, they want to... They just saying it... They're going to come to you with some shit. Abundance. Because they see you abundant. You've done the hard work. You've done the work. Abundance flows to you now. So, like, past life love, yeah. They see you living abundantly. they coming in, but they're still in the devilish energy. Like, I'm just, I'm not even going to sugarcoat it because that's just what it is. But they definitely trying to come in. They trying to come in heavy, too. Second house. Everything this person is. Everything this person in this situation may own and claim is theirs, money, possession, self-worth, self. Yeah, this person swear, this person think they own you, who? Capricornish, you got you a devil on your hands. This person is a boss in the street still, but they think they own you. Or somebody just feels, oh, they the boss of you, period. Like, they own you. Somebody want to own you. Um, Somebody may want to marry you. But they bossy, they in devilish energy, but somebody will marry you here. Somebody, somebody, somebody want to own you. Somebody want to marry you. 
But it's going to be a toxic situation. And you may you may do this. Because you won't see them as a boss. You'll be like, I'm going to marry this motherfucker. You, you won't see an opportunity here. But with evidence, you're going to find some evidence. Something's going to come out about this person. And you may be dealing with this person. Yeah, you're going to come up out of being mad and upset about something. Yeah, this person will mess up your, 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 your reputation. Friendships. Your job, your self-worth. This person is going to be hooked when you are. They are already hooked on you. You may caught them in the act. They come up out of acting young. They telling you this is you. It's an ex lover, but they was on some other shit. You confident right now, but they somebody is fucked up in their head over you, and they like drama. So just be on the lookout for somebody to just do crazy shit, cause that's how they do. <sighs> this is love. Next forty eight, man. Let's see what the angel guy may come out about. They don't know how to just leave Cap Capricorn and Shalom. We be chilling. We don't got time for your bullshit. And the shit you talking and on. What is going on? Look at look for a sign. You're gonna see a sign about something here, and you want to be on point. And it's a no and yes. You just gotta look for a sign from divine. It's not meant for you to find out through me. Whatever you, whatever's going on here, it's not meant for me to find out. Three cards came out. That's usually what I pick. It's three cards that came out, so I have to stop. I don't can't keep going on that. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? Capricorn, just knowing yeah, it's something in your life. You gotta figure out which one it is. It's not for me to know. Next forty eight in love. You just want a happy picnic. This could be a happy life. Or maybe you got a picnic you going to and you just want everybody to be normal Capricorn. Because, like, this is you. You, like, you chilling. You just getting your money. You got the hair fine here. And you don't feel like dealing with that shit. You don't, you don't, you don't got time for up and down family ships, people high and shit. And you already on the throne. You already got your abundance. You see? You're not... This is what you come up. Well, this is what you have. You come up out of dealing with manipulative people, having people shit on your back. You like, I don't want to know nothing about them lies. They don't want to walk away. That's on them. They want to lie to the divine. That's on them. They don't want to buzz change their life. That's on them. Yeah, they snakes. They be trying to plot, but you already know they bad news. You already know they lies, and you victorious over your enemies. So their lies. Is the reason why they can't ha make nothing happen in their life. They come up out of trying to watch you and worry about your money because you close cycles with them. So they really don't know what's going on. They just unhappy here. You be dealing with a Leo here. They, 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 they trying to juggle you, but you're balanced. Even with this new love that's coming in place here, but somebody from your past coming back to take some type of chance again. Water sign energy. They feel wounded and no new beginning with you here. But you didn't use your intuition in the past with this person. You cut them off, though. Because you start seeing something. But you waited. You didn't know which way to go. Yeah, this person was in devilish energy and you was at peace. Yeah, it's always like that. The motherfuckers. We be chilling. They be coming to us with some bullshit. A message you won't. A message you won't be able to ignore. So you may get a message you may not be able to ignore. Switch up which way you walk and drive. I know I do. Web of deceit. Do you at do you at all costs? Huh, I know that's right. God damn. Strings attached. Whammy. That's the energy. Like somebody like they own you. You may not even know this, but this person, they want a climax with you. Somebody wants to sleep with you. Somebody want somebody wants you to make them come here. Or you want to make somebody come here. This could be somebody that's the same sex with you. This could be for same sex energy too. Don't lose sleep over it. 
you thinking about a climax you had maybe with the same sex. Maybe you not fully bisexual. Maybe you had a one night stand and it was a it was the same sex that brought you to a climax. I heard them are spectacular. But don't lose sleep over it. It was fun, but wake up here. Yeah. It's not your life. Yeah. So if you had a one night stand with a um same sex situation far as ma massive and feminine whatever whatever y'all did it brought you to a complete climax oh that's what i need but don't lose sleep over it because it's not your life that was just fun the haters is home you may be dealing with people that be hating maybe because you you like same sex relationships here they got a gambling problem. What they worrying about you? That life falling apart? Okay. I see. More hated energy. Alright. Well, that's what I have for you. This is the next 48. So, you got love coming towards you. And then you got other stuff going on. At the end of the day, I definitely see you. You bossing here. Slowly. This is how they, this is how they see you. So, you won't have all this devilish energy. It's serious. They focus on your money. They watching your bag, Capricorn. Seriously. When they should be watching their own. There's rules to that shit. 